Hello. So, after getting my speak and spell uh, chip thing um, up and running, uh, I thought it would be fun to uh, work that into the barbecue. Because who doesn't want to make projects talk? Well, that's kind of cool, right? My whole goal with the barbecue is to kind of um, A, teach, but B, inspire projects. Because it, I'm a firm believer in that uh, people have a hard time learning new, completely new things if they don't have a project or a goal to work towards. So I want people to kind of come up with ideas on their own so that they're theirs. Um, sort of like an inception thing. I want to like stick ideas in their head. Anyway, um, we've got a little photo uh, cell right there um, connected to the standard pull-up resistor dealing with jigger. Um, if you don't know what pull-up resistor is, I will explain that on the barbecue day. Um, and it's just going to the analog zero pin. Uh, you can follow that blue wire there. Um, the other guys are going to 3.3 volts, going to ground. Um, but I thought it'd be cool if I just uh, used the speak and spell, the voice box shield, as a way to output data. Um, so how I'm programming these things are, I'm finding that many program, many of these combinations of inputs and outputs are going to use the same programs. Um, standard like analog in, analog out, analog in, PWM out, analog in, voice box out, analog in, servo out. Certain things require special programs, but most are just going to be like analog or the digital ones will, will, will require some special tweaking. But anyway, I'm going to plug this in and you're going to hear what's going on immediately because I already programmed it up there. So, it's reading out the data from, from this guy. If I cover it up, 34. Now it's less. What if I take my hand a little bit away? A little bit more. And then clue away. Pretty cool, right? So basically, I'll unplug this now. It's just spitting out uh, strings. I had to do a decent bit of code to get that to happen because I had to convert the numbers into string versions of the thingamajigs. But anyway, who cares? Um, this is pretty much replaceable with any sort of analog input, which is like a light sensor. That's what we got here. IR detector. Um, uh, gotta get something for Dustin in a minute. It's my reminder. Uh, microphone is gonna be analog. Thermistor will be analog. Uh, accelerometer. Pressure is gonna be analog. Um, potential meter is analog. Joystick is analog. But analog. so all of those things are gonna be the same thing. Um, you can imagine joystick. It'll read out the position of the joystick. Um, as you move it around, button it'll just keep saying off, 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 or on. Um, or in this case, I guess it'd be one zero 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 one. Maybe I'll special make a special one for that so it only says something when you press a button. But anyway, I just thought that was interesting. Kind of a fun thing. Okay, bye.